This is a Mercedes-Benz Vito 119 Bluetech Sport Tourer. It's a 2.2, it's a 2016 on a 16 plate. Uh, really good specification, it's done 26,045 miles. Last service at uh, 23,640. It's automatic, we've no fuel consumption on this unfortunately, but um, I'll try and take you through some of the spec as we go. Right, automatic. The auto selector is on the steering column on the right hand side there. So into drive, as you can see there, we've got um, sat nav. We've got height and reach adjustable steering wheel. Let's just, uh, it's an absolutely shocking day today in Preston. It doesn't know whether to snow or rain or whatever, but it's, it's dismal. One of the things I always find with this setup on Mercedes-Benz, um, when I go to switch the wipers on, which you'll probably notice me do during this test drive at least once, I knock it into neutral um, because the gear selectors there are not down here as you would expect it to be. Um, you do get used to it. I have used a Mercedes-Benz uh, for a while myself and it eventually sunk in even to my thick skull, so uh, you'll have to bear with me today. Um, we've got cruise control down here, we've got multifunction steering wheel. Now, I only jumped in this vehicle two minutes ago to make this video, so I don't know the complete spec, but I did notice um, it's got one or two things on which I'll just try and go through or work my way through. It's got um, Bluetooth hands free. Now it also tells me it's got distance warning and uh, attention assist, blind spot assist. Now I can see a little triangle in the mirror there so we'll have a look as we're going along lane keep assist there's a symbol in the middle two white lines with a car in the center we'll see if that's got anything to do with it never had a mercedes with that on before And it's also got either leather upholstery or Artico leather, which is a uh, man-made leather. Uh, harder wearing, easier to clean. Uh, leather these days, they, they used to make um, the colouring with a solvent and now everything has to be solvent free so it's water based and the, uh, the colour's not as hard wearing as it used to be and in some cases if you go to clean it you can even wash the colour off Artico leather not so much a problem it's also not as expensive We've got something rattling in the back there it's very very dark it's also got tinted glass so I've had to try and put a light so as you can see in the back there but again the, the lights rattling so you'll have to you'll have to excuse this uh, this video today the, uh, the conditions aren't ideal we'll see whether the motorway is clear and if so I'll take you up there all oh, right yes I can I'll uh, I'll just try and show you you probably can't see but if I cross the white line, or it's recognised as a line there, if I cross it without indicating, the steering wheel vibrates. Um, unfortunately, there's a lot of traffic coming the other way, but we'll just say. OK, 
دور بله Road's very wet. The centre of the road's flooded, but I'm, I'm pretty sure I felt it vibrate back there. Yeah, there you go. It's picked the lines up there, and it uh, vibrates the steering wheel, so you're crossing it. Just go on to blind spot assist, so that's activated. And, uh, pretty sure it'll light up the triangles in the corner of the mirrors if there's anything in my blind spot. The motorway doesn't look too bad, it's a bit horrible but uh, we'll see what it drives like. So we've got five seats anyway and a big load area. Front centre armrests. Nice comfortable seats. Pretty sure we've got power folding door mirrors, but we're going too fast for them to work. Automatic gearbox, got paddle shift on the steering wheel. Up here, see if the. Uh... Yeah, there you go. So we've got power folding door mirrors as well. Just stupid eco stop start where your flywheel start a motor and all your engine mountings out, but save yourself two quid in fuel. Can knock it off though. I don't know where. When I was at Mercedes Benz, um, my company car used to cost me something absolutely horrendous every month in, uh, in car tax. And uh, most of the day, go to work in it, it would sit outside the garage until 6, 7 o'clock at night, then I'd go home, then it'd be sat outside my house. I never used to go out in it because I was always trying to get it vandalised, and it was costing me hundreds of pounds a month. So I decided that you could have a van and just pay 500 pounds a year in income tax. And I got a, a veto, put a veto on the road with uh, a reasonable spec. And I can tell you they drive fantastic, use them every day, they're comfortable like, like this. It, it's just so nice to drive. And if I could have got one of these, it would have been even better. But I just had a panel back then. <laughs>
sometimes the camera cuts through the haze, but I can tell you today is just horrible. Got a rear wash wipe there. Cruise control. That's cruise activated. I'll be able to increase it. There you go. It's up to 70 miles an hour, but I don't think I'll be doing that. in a grey metallic which is the name escapes me however to me it looks kind of a bronzy grey colour with black probably article leather with uh, contrasting ivory stitching vehicles like new the person that uh, that's had this previously is meticulous with his vehicles we've had numerous of his old cars off him and uh, vans and motorbikes and they're always absolutely immaculate Superb. Remember to cut that out. It's a roundabout, it's a motorway roundabout. Big signs everywhere. There's a big Mercedes van coming and it still didn't stop. This is Russian hat was uh, covering his eyes or something. myself first or during Isofix child seats there 
each seat folds down in individually and I'm pretty sure that you can take them out as well so you've got uh, Is fitted, um, so you can crack the window a little bit and not get any uh, rain in or reduce wind noise. Speed limit on the, the road you're on. Nice big door pockets down here, cup holder there cup or flask holder down there, big oddments tray there. Seat is uh, height adjustable, it's winding up there, or certainly the, the rake of the seat. glass area, nice visibility all round. Lights must have just come on, this uh, sat nav's gone into night mode. Don't create glare. And here we are back at the garage. Okay, click the end there, and uh, we're in park. <laughs> 